I'm vegetarian, so I'm gonna just swoop. <laughs> Don't call it a comeback, but we back. Good, Good morning, morning Minneapolis. Minneapolis. Justin, how are you feeling? I am feeling incredible, electric. It's been a year, and it's been a, a year, year. A year, literally, it's been a year. Yeah. You can feel it in your body. Yes. You can feel it in your bones. Yes, it is in our DNA. It's psychologically. It's mitochondria. It's been a year. Yes, everything is feeling it. Yes. We're, we're, we're feeling it. Are you feeling it? Yeah. Because we're here with you. We're here Are with you. Are you okay? Yeah. If you're not, you're about to be better. It's but you're going to be a more ascended human being after yes. this. Yes. We are spiritually ascending. Okay, Justin, are you ready? I'm I, I've been ready forever. I mean, are you ready, muchacho? Oh, I've been ready for the 2024 Minnesota State Fair New Food Breakdown. Afro Deli is back with Afro Poppers, bite-sized pastries infused with a blend of spices, ground vanilla, mm. cardamom, mm. ginger, cloves, and nutmeg. What? That's not a blend. That's a spice rack, y'all. A whole one. Girl. Take a break from the deep state theories and get down to Afro Deli for this deep fried reality coated with coconut flakes, sugar, or served plain. My goodness. Newly crowned State Fair royalty is back. If you don't know about them, where the f have you been? Where the f have you been? It's Baba's with the bacon sour cream and onion. That sour cream and onion hummus for you rookies topped with beef, bacon, sumac, tater tots, caramelized onions, mm. scallions. Holy f this is crazy championship level combinations served with pita puffs. I'm vegetarian, so I'm gonna just watch from above on the sky glide before I touch down at the pickle station and swoop over for the veggie option. Mm. Ring, ring. Fire department, y'all okay? No, it's a blaze over here. Say what? Mm, with Dino's Euros blazing green bites. bites. Deep fried bites made from a blend of chickpeas, what? tomato, mm. roasted red pepper, scallions, and cayenne pepper. This ain't Minnesota spicy. Nah. This is Yanni's and Tata Kung Pao Giannis, 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 Giannis Antetokounmpo. Giannis and Tata Kung Pao. I, like, I don't even know how to say it. You got it. We now. got it though. Better get an XL lemonade before you enter these blazing waters. Woo woo! It ain't the St. Paul PD. It's Sausage Sister and Me with three piggy pals on a stick. Three smoked sausage slices wrapped in bacon, injected with the cream cheese mix, and accentuated with barbecue sauce, topped with a rare slice of jalapeno in Minnesota. Mm. The spice and BBQ sauce are so unlikely in Minnesota. It's like a Meg Ryan, Tom Hanks team up. Just when you thought they'd never find love, here they are, sleepless at the State Fair. Like the universe, cheese curds at the Minnesota State Fair continue to expand. Forever. And they just arrived in a new zip code at Richie's Cheese Curd Tacos as blue cheese curd and chicken tacos. Fry, buffalo flavored cheese curds and mm. chicken topped with blue cheese slaw in a fried flour shell. You can't argue with the universe, baby. Namaste. Namaste. Anthony Edwards may go hard in the paint, but Tasty Whip goes soft serve in a cup with mango dough rimmed and topped with chamoy and tagine for the chili mango whip. It's hot out here, y'all. Oh, so yeah, get this spiced yeah. up soft serve before it melts like my hopelessly optimistic heart. Oh, cookie crumble in the jungle. It's Ooh. mini donuts and cheese curds with cookie butter crunch mini donuts. Tiny Tim, where are you at? You better watch yourself because your product is getting cookie butter crunched with vanilla flavored mini donuts, coated with vanilla mm. sugar, topped with Biscoff cookie butter drizzle and cookie Biscoff. crumbles, served in a bucket, rimmed with cookie butter and cookie crumbles. Illegal. Sweet Martha's wondering what the f is happening right now. What? They rimmed the cookie bucket. They rimmed it. Take a moment to meditate on that and just appreciate. All that glory. Loon Lake Ice Tea just lost their damn mind and decided to break the laws of the multiverse with the cotton candy iced tea. Keep your kids away from this. It's yeah. brewed butterfly pea flower tea sweetened with cane sugar and garnished with edible glitter? Edible glitter? And a rock candy swizzle stick to stir for a color changing oh. effect. This is pure sugar magic. This More powerful sorcery. than the eye of Agamotto. It bends the laws of reality what? and will affect the time space continuum. Nah, girl, it's not 1991. The twins ain't won a thing, but we dancing in the streets just because. Oh, 
Soul Bowl has returned with delicious alchemy. They're putting chicken wings in a crab boil. That's crazy. Finished with a lemon wedge and parsley, and then marinated in hot sauce with the new crab boil wings. And don't forget the chicken apple sausage and potato. Yes, SpongeBob's bathing in the bayou with this one. It ain't real. Holy Holy Land Deli is back with the deep fried halloumi cheese. Oh. We talked about this last year and they're just not stopping. Halloumi cheese wrapped in pastry dough, served with a side of sweet chili sauce. It's vegetarian. It already has my money. Mm, everybody shut the f up and listen up. Someone just deep fried the ranch dressing. Insane. Lulu's Public House has just shifted tectonic plates and offended pacifists We're with fighting. their new deep fried ranch dressing. Buttermilk and cream cheese in a panko shell deep fried and dusted with ranch powder. This is ranch power. I mean, I feel like JR in Dallas telling Patrick Duffy to get the hell off the ranch. What's next? Do we deep fry vinaigrette? <laughs> <laughs> You're not even a sub boss, let alone a top boss. Cause they just dropped that new, new dill pickle tots, fried dill seasoning with a hint of vinegar in case you ain't feeling it. They say it's like a dill pickle potato chip, but it's a tater tot. Roz better check these people if they're talking about pickles like this. Sabino's Pizza Pies are here with their fried banana pie. Mm. Handmade pie filled with Minnesota honey, fresh banana, and Biscoff cookie butter. What? This is like ancient Scandinavian ancestral magic in a deep fried pie. Union Mung Kitchen got the lease renewed and they pulling up with the grilled purple sticky rice on a stick. Oh my gosh. Justin, rice on a stick, are you kidding me? Oh, hemispheres are colliding right now. Purple sticky rice grilled over an open flame till crunchy, then topped with shredded mung beef jerky or pickled mushrooms. This has to be illegal in Wisconsin. Thank God we're in Minnesota. <laughs> Ham and pickle roll up on a potato skin by Route 66 Roadhouse Chicken. Three fried potato skins filled with a blend of sour cream, cream cheese, chopped pickles and ham and topped with potato chip crumbles? They can't do this. Oh, this money finna roll up out of my pocket and purchase one of these on its own. Ladies Slipper Marble Sundae by Bridgman's Ice Cream. Strawberry ice cream, lemon marshmallow cream, and ladyfinger cookies layered in a cup topped with whipped cream and a cherry. This like the board game Candyland when you were a kid, except it's in a cup and you're an adult now and you gotta pay taxes and Oh man, I hate paying taxes. I don't do it. <laughs> J -j -j Jammy Sammy's by Brim presents Marco's Garden. This looks like something out of your aunt's cookbook that was seasoned and curated by a Betty Crocker film crew, except it's actually available in real, real life, life at the state fair. Reality is what you make of it. Law of assumption, law of attraction. Hey, this is in Sparta. This is madness. Mm. Mocha madness shave ice from Minna Snowy Shave Ice, fluffy shave ice with caffeine free coffee. Say it. Coating an overflowing caramel macchiato cold foam center. Are you crazy? Ooh. Chocolate syrup, chocolate espresso beans. Call me Count Chocula the midway because I'm swooping in on this and my fangs are out. Oh man, sucking it all up. <laughs> baby, baby, baby. baby. It may be in St. Paul, but Minneapolis is in the mother of building. Yes, Midtown Global Market's Indigenous Food Lab brings you Nick's Tamal and Wild Rice Bowl with wasabi and bison meatballs or sweet potato dumplings. I mean, why haven't you started your car yet to get here? Choice of bison meatballs or sweet potato dumplings with mixed berry wasabi sauce on a bed of Nick's tamal. What? You are welcome, St. Paul. You're welcome. And Southside is also in the ma house. house. West End Creamery called Rectangle Pizza to crack the code on this focaccia bread to make the patata frita focaccia witch. Focaccia witch. A focaccia kettle witch. Witch. Focaccia witch. Kettle chip flavored ice cream created by Minnesota oh Dairy God. Lab. This is science, Justin. And it's topped with honey butter and kettle chips. Girl, you don't need a map. This is the way to my heart. You can have all of my heart, baby. Rise and grind, we at the Blue Barn with PB Bacon Cakes. Thick cut bacon dipped in pancake batter, griddled and topped with peanut butter whipped cream, grape jelly, and banana chips. Top of the morning to y'all. I just wanna say PB Bacon Cake sounds like the cowboy that actually like, you know, did good for once in his life. Was just right. tired of being like 
People like the yeah. Robin Hood of Cowboys. Yeah, PB Bacon Cakes was he had a he was tough living up until like you know 45, and then right. he really turned things around. I'm I'm voting for PB Bacon Cakes. And you can find him at the Blue Barn. Hey, hey, ring ring. Uh, what's up? She say she saw you at the Vegetarian Club, Justin. Nah, I never seen her before. It's the raging ball by the herbivorous butcher. Deep fried sesame mochi dough ball with vegan cheeseburger filling. I feel like I'm rapping right now. House made vegan burger mix, vegan cheddar cheese, grilled onions and pickles. I'm vegetarian. This means a lot to me. Oh More than words. Gosh. I'm starting to tear up, dog. Oh my gosh. Savory eclairs by Scenic 61 by New Scenic Cafe. Almost as many titles as the Minnesota Lynx. Almost. A pastry eclair shell with choice of banh mi mm. or lobster your feeling. Uh, hello, I'll take both. Why wouldn't you? <laughs> it's a taste of Uptown at the State Fair. And no, I don't mean the traffic on Lindale. It's French Meadow Bakery's shroomy calamari, oyster mushrooms, ham breaded and deep fried, served with a side of chipotle sauce. She! Oh, oh, White Chicks was a cult classic, sure was. but they may need to move over for waffle chicks, strawberry, strawberry and, and cream waffle, waffle stick. stick. Belgian waffle filled with strawberry shortcake cookie dough mm. topped with whipped cream and a strawberry sauce that's on a stick. What? I'll say that again. Sauce on a stick. I mean, the laws of gravity and physics be damned because waffle chicks is up to something dangerous, delicious, and magical. No qualified immunity here, but I'm looking for a donut. A Fluffy's hand cut, cut donut, donut strawberry, strawberry lemonade, lemonade donut. donut. Hand-cut yeast-raised donut frosted with lemon buttercream, rolled in strawberry lemonade crunch, and garnished with lemon gummy candy and freeze-dried strawberry slice? What, what the f is even real anymore? What the f is even real? I mean, it may be Salem Lutheran Church Dining Hall, but mm. folks are sweating these Swedish ice cream sundaes Ooh. like a Pentecostal pastor in a church tent on a Sunday in July. Mm. Vanilla ice cream covered in lingonberry jam, sprinkled with Swedish ginger cookie crumble and garnished with a ginger cookie heart. It's like Ikea, but without the furniture. Preach. Me and your grandma talking about life goals and Jimmy Carter's run down at the Hamlin Church dining hall with Swedish soda sliders, cranberry wild rice meatball formed into patties, paired with dill Havarti cheese and a red relish of beets, red onions, red peppers, lingonberries, cranberries. Call Helen Hunt. I'm Jack Nicholson. This is good as it gets. I think we all can handle that truth. Before we get to the midway, meet me at the Blue Moon Dining Theater for a sweet corn cola float. Mm. Corn cola, sweet corn ice cream in a cup, whipped cream, popping candy, and a house-made frozen caramel. A new Dairy King has just been crowned. King me. Used to hit illegal speeds on Nintendo and RC Pro-Am. Now I slow down for RC's barbecue for their sweet heat bacon crunch. Double smoked slab bacon tossed in RC's red barbecue sauce with hot honey and chili crunch served over white rice. This that southern comfort for your Midwest passivity you have yet to address because you think not talking about it will make it go away, but it really won't, dog. <laughs> Call the Teamsters for a bullhorn and a flatbed Woo! because we're headed to the Minnesota Farmers Union coffee shop for Turkey Cristo, Minnesota made Texas toast. Mm. Got it from Panagold Bakery, yep. sliced with Ferndale Market Turkey, yep. Cannon Bell's White Cheddar Cheese, and Apple Butter, made from locally sourced Westcott Orchard Apples. <laughs> it's what? better made because it's union made. Hey, These taste buds just unionized. You can't bust up this flavor profile. Try it, try it, we dare you. St. Paul's finest, and I ain't talking about a civil lawsuit. I'm talking about O'Gara's at the State Fair with the Walking Shepherd's Pie. Two handmade hot pastries filled with braised ground beef, mashed potatoes, and a blend of onions, carrots, and peas tossed in herb oh, gravy? herb gravy. Cut the GPS. Just follow the sound of bagpipes, and you'll find me at O'Gara's, dog. Seasoned State Fair veterans, Nordic Waffles, have done it again. They did it. The Wrangler Waffle Burger is here for your heart. Fresh all beef patty and signature Whataburger patty melt sauce layered with American cheese mm. and served in a caramelized, onion-infused Nordic waffle. Valhalla is on Earth. Open oh, sesame. Let's go. Yes. It's not just new foods, Justin. There are some new vendors here as well. Yeah, getting into the state fair is tougher than getting your kid on the waiting list to get into a Spanish immersion school in Eden Prairie. It may take forever. Chan's Eatery is here and they're serving up Korean corn dogs, 
hot dog and mozzarella cheese battered with panko, deep fried and finished with a dusting of cinnamon sugar, get the chance and make their Minnesota State Fair dreams come true. Oh, El Burrito Mercado serving Queso Birria Taquitos, mm. deep fried roll tacos filled with beef marinated in red sauce and what? cheese. Okay, stop making excuses stop. and get to El Burrito Mercado. Kosharina Egyptian cuisine has landed and they're serving kashari. Rice, pasta, chickpeas, Ooh. lentils, tomato sauce, garlicky vinegar topped with fried onions. Look, I've been campaigning for this for a long time personally. More rice at the state fair, let's get it. I agree. Loon Lake iced tea. They're serving some cotton candy iced tea and a variety of other cane sugar sweetened iced teas, including blood orange, mm. blueberry, yeah. peach, and okay. strawberry. Let's go. It's like love bombing in the form of sugar and deliciousness. Lake Street has arrived and St. Paul will never be the same. The Midtown Global Markets Indigenous Food Lab is in the house. And as you've heard amongst the heated arguments, somebody say, I ain't the one or the two. The Indigenous Food Lab is the one and the two, the alpha, the omega, and the rest of the numerical catalog you can conceive in your brain. Get to this one of a kind and very special food vendors or don't come to the state fair at all. I mean that. Mm. Check it out, the Paella Depot. Yeah. They're serving chicken and chorizo paella. Get out of here. A what? traditional Spanish caramelized rice dish with leeks, red bell pepper, zucchini, and snap peas. Oh my goodness. You haven't had paella at the fair, so why wouldn't you take your partner to try it out and then make plans to fly to Segovia, Spain to try traditional paella? And then pull up to the Minnesota State Fair in 2047 to introduce your kids to the meal that brought you and your partner together after a really tough election year. It's been a year. It's been a heck of a year. Well, that'll do it for the new food and vendor roundup for the that Minnesota State is Fair. A wrap. Justin, yeah. we, the people are all asking and clamoring, what are you most excited about for this year's State Fair? I it doesn't would, even have to be food. Well, I would say, yeah, food food is always number one. Uh, I, I really want to like open the conversation up to the people around ah, like, what is the yes. fair story? What's everybody's fair story? We all have one. What does that look like? What are people's like little hidden gems, yeah, favorite yeah. spots to go? Everyone's got like their fair plan. I'd like to know what people's fair yeah. plans are. Yeah, yeah. And and especially with like partners, you know, we don't always have the same fair plan. No. So how do you get on the same page when you're at the Minnesota State Fair? Mama, get on the same fair page with me. Get on the same state fair page <laughs> with me, Mama. Well, I also think that some yeah. people come to the fair and they don't have a plan, and that's part of the fun, right? That's the magic, is you just sort of wing it. I'm a winger. I yeah, I was yeah. gonna say, what, what kind of planner are you? Or just no plan at all? I have no plan. I just sort of go, I find it. It's, it's very much a intuition thing. When they reboot Tango and Cash, it'll be me and you at the state fair looking us. for the bad guy. Yeah, That's there's like a crime be. syndicate in the fair and we gotta take him down. <laughs> well, I don't think the fair is gonna let us film there if we're talking about that. <laughs> it's gonna be the Scandinavian Mafia, and I tell you what. We're coming for a, you. They're from a little town in Minnesota. Never heard of it? They don't want you to. <laughs> <laughs> well, one thing I will say that I'm excited about, there's a secret coffee shop at the fair, and I, I wanna go there and just sit and read for a moment, just like, just, in, just amongst the chaos. The secret coffee the shop. The secret coffee shop. Wow. What is it this movie, The Secret Garden? The Secret Garden. The Secret Coffee Shop. We're going to go there. We're going to read some books. I went there with Master Delaware yesterday. Read books with him. Yes. I listened to all the chatter from everybody else. It we journaled and delighted. made puppets out of socks. <laughs> People looked at this funny, but don't mind them. Right. Uh, well, that'll do it for us. Haters gonna hate. Haters gonna hate. <laughs> Can that be a new musical? Haters gonna hate. Coming Haters to gonna the, hate. Ball is gonna ball. Haters gonna hate. Ball is gonna ball. That'll do it for us We're at done. Good Morning Minneapolis for the 2024 Minnesota so State Fair, Fair New Food, food Breakdown Review. review. Yeah. yeah. And so we, we breakdown. We look it's a forward. breakdown. It it's a breakdown. Review. It's a breakdown. Yeah, we didn't really review breakdown. anything, but we hope you got something yeah, out of it. We appreciate you. Thank Go you to so onsitepublicmedia.com and check the link in the description below to, to, to donate and help us keep programs yep. like this going. We appreciate you. We'll see you in the next one.